Glad that we were able to uh, pull out this game. I thought they did a good job trying to control the tempo. Certainly not the tempo that we want to play at, but uh, like I said, give Steve and his, his uh, team credit for uh, you know trying to slow it down, and we found a way to you know still maintain and execute when we needed to. Wasn't pretty, but a win is a win. Non-league basically got us ready for this uh, upcoming you know conference play right now. Um, we played different and high like high level teams, uh, top 25 teams, like right? top 100 teams in the country right now. Well, back in the non-conference, which got us ready in the off season. And now it's like, okay, we play these teams. We know what they're capable of. Let's bring our best talent and let's do what we have to do to stay number one as they have us ranked. Basically, it's more of like focus on uh, being efficient and being able to like finish off like the right way, especially coming in game time, you get tired, you know, it's basically mentally strong. So we just have to focus on the defensive part more than the offense because the offense will come eventually like tonight. Just had to be tough on defense and offense as well, so. It's a, it's a mental thing. It's, it's, it's preparing to know that when you play Manhattan, that it's going to be a physical game and it's not going to be an up and down game. They're going to come down, they're going to execute, they're going to run plays, they're going to screen, they're going to be physical on defense and they're going to go at you. And Steve's a good coach, does a good job with his team, but yet it gives us an opportunity to play in some of these games where we got to be disciplined. We got to move the ball, we got to execute, we got to go inside and got to take our time when we go inside. We missed a lot of layups, but um, you know, it's a mindset.